So there's some things that come almost naturally to men that women find really, really attractive. This video seeks to highlight all of these things and make you take note of the fact that honing these particular things and exhibiting these traits can inure to your benefit as a man and make you seem very, very attractive to almost all women. Want to know what those are? Stay tuned. Welcome back, my name is Jessica. This is my YouTube channel. Don't forget, you can have a one-on-one -on -one video call with me to chat about anything that you'd like to talk about. Just join my Patreon community. Just go to patreon.com forward slash Jessica OS and join my VIP community and you should be good to go. Now that that's out of the way, let's jump right in. Masculine traits that women find irresistible. Number one, presence presence. Now there's something that women find irresistible when it comes to men and it's about presence. It's about being in the moment, living in the moment and just dwelling on what is right in front of you right now. I mean, when I say presence, it's your ability to stay connected to the here and now and leave tomorrow to care for itself. Now you see, we live in a world where there are so many distractions, so many distractions. I mean, take a short drive for say one mile and you most likely will see a lot of advertisements, listen to a lot of stuff on the radio, just everything is seeking your attention and preventing you from living in the here and now. Now, one of the most powerful masculine traits is being able to exist in the now and assimilate and process everything that's going on around you in this moment when it comes to the woman in your life. Why is this important? It makes her feel like when you're with her, it, she's the only thing that matters. You see, more often than not, men are busy doing other things. They're listening to their women passively whilst they engage in other things that they deem more important. And so men who are able to live in the present, who are able to really pay attention to what is going on, to the women in their lives and their thoughts, feelings, etc., are able to really win over a woman's love and affection because she feels like you really, really care. Having a strong presence when you're with a woman is a feather in any man's cap. And it's a trait that absolutely must be honed over time to ensure that the woman in your life is happy. Best advice, try not to multitask when she wants your attention. Maybe she has something she would like to tell you. Maybe she needs your advice or direction on something. And multitasking or giving her half your attention does not make her feel like what she's saying is so important to you. And she may end up confiding in other people outside your relationship. So give her the gift of your presence and she will stay with you for a very long time. Number two, purpose. Now a man with purpose is hot. Oh yeah. Women like to know that he knows exactly what he wants. He's got his eyes fixated on a certain future and he's hell bent on reaching it no matter what, no matter the circumstances or the impediments that are thrown in his way. You see, your purpose can be any number of things. It can be to change the world. It can be to build a better version of yourself by working out. It can be to build a new business or even to build homes. It can also be to be the kindest person you know. Whatever your purpose is, know that it's really important for women to feel like you have goals and a purpose to this whole thing called life. And that's the only way you're going to get them to follow you. Women don't like to follow men who don't seem to know where they're going. And having a purpose and a good one at that is always a good indicator of a man who's thinking ahead and thinking into the future. So get this. It's not so much about what your purpose is. It's just the fact that you actually have a purpose and you're working towards that goal diligently. Number three is direction. Now purpose and direction are close cousins because with purpose comes direction. Now purpose is knowing what you're here to do and direction is actually moving towards that thing, that purpose, that goal. Direction is actually doing it. Women are very attracted to men who get things done. The fastest way to lose trust, lose respect as a man is to not be a man of your word. Cause over time, if you tell your woman something, 
she's going to doubt you and doubt your ability to actually fulfill it or complete it. And that is going to be akin to a carpenter holding a chisel and a hammer and just chiseling away at some kind of object. That will be all the trust, the faith that your woman has in you being diminished every single time you're not able to stick to your word. Women like to know that you have a plan, that you're working towards that plan. You're taking, even if they're baby steps, at least you're not remaining stagnant. You are working hard and assiduously to try to bring those plans to fruition. Your clear sense of direction makes a woman feel safe. She feels like the captain of this ship knows exactly what he's doing and where he's going. She knows that you can navigate well on your own and she doesn't have to panic, but she can sit back and pretty much enjoy the ride. She doesn't have to show you how to do it because you already know how to do it. And I know sometimes this is a very difficult expectation that women put on men because I do acknowledge the fact that you don't know everything. Sometimes you don't even know where you're going. But you see, letting the woman in your life know that you don't know where you're going is a totally different thing. You can not know where you're going, but still keep that ship or that relationship in your life moving forward, however small. But once a woman picks up on the fact that you have no direction whatsoever, she's going to start losing trust in your abilities and your ability to lead. Number four is honesty and trust. And obviously honesty and trust are very important traits or qualities when it comes to relationships and how successful they will actually be. Buttressing previous points. If she does not trust you enough or feel like you're being honest with her enough about maybe your life, your shortcomings, your goals and achievements, where you want to go, what you want to do, she is more likely not to follow you on that journey. Trust comes from acting in honest ways, but the definition actually goes a little beyond that. Now question is, can a woman trust that you actually know where you're going? Can a woman trust that you're being honest with yourself in your dealings and in dealing with other people? One of the distinct Feminine qualities is their intuition and you should never take that for granted. Some way, somehow women just happen to know these things and she can smell BS from a mile away. So don't ever think that if you don't have your ducks in a row as a man, or you don't have any purpose or sense of direction, you're just going to be able to bullshit your way through this life and have some woman who's worth her salt follow you all the way to the end and probably over a cliff. Trust and honesty are very powerful adhesives when it comes to relationships. I guess what I'm trying to say is when you learn to be deeply honest about yourself as a man, I mean, you're aware of your shortcomings, you know what your strengths are, and you're able to communicate that effectively to a woman. The key word is effectively to the woman in your life. She will realize just how human you are and she will support you. Women typically like to support the men that they love, the people that they care about. And if you are able to be sincere with her about your dreams and your fears, your shortcomings and your setbacks, she most likely will offer you her trust and be honest with you in return about things that bother her. And finally, let's talk about humor. Now, some guys tend to overdo this particular one and try to force the humor. Forced humor is actually very annoying. If you're naturally a guy who's able to be, think quickly on his feet and make light of situations and things around you, then you are halfway there. Humor doesn't necessarily mean that you have to crack jokes every single time to get her to laugh. But you see why humor is big on this list is because a lot of women tend to be really bogged down by life, stressed out. And the last thing they need is a guy who's just too serious and takes life and everything else so seriously that he cannot connect to her on a lighter level. Knowing that you have a funny guy who can just make you feel relaxed when you're stressed out, who can make you feel like, you know, it's okay. You had a bad day today. Let's go eat a cheeseburger and think about how we can make tomorrow even better. And you know, just create humor and create light of some of life life's very difficult challenges, then she will begin to have a lot of faith in you. She'll be relaxed around you. She can be herself around you because she knows that, Hey, you know what? In as much as life is serious business, never take life too seriously because 
We all don't get out alive anyway. Have fun while you're at it. She doesn't want to come home to this always serious, never smiling, life is war kind of guy. She wants to know that he can kick off his shoes, lean back in his armchair, and just make her feel like, you know what, it's okay. Today was a bad day, but so what? Tomorrow can get better. And he's developed humorous ways of delivering that truth. Women like to feel comfortable around guys. And if you're able to really hone your humor skill, you will have a lot of women hanging around you because that's just positive vibes and positive energy. Yep, so those are some of the masculine traits that women find really irresistible lights just went off it means it's my cue to um, wrap up this video but my name is Jessica thanks for watching let me go charge up that light see you later